U.S. and Spain about to kick off in Pamplona, Spain. The women's international friendly. U.S. in the all-white kit going right to left on your screen. Spain in the red top. Iran, one on one. Put to the back post, falls to Mace. Mace on her left foot. Blocked away by Sornosa. Claudia Sornosa with a big defensive play to keep us scoreless. We saw it grow against Sweden. It took them a good 15 minutes to build into it, but here's a really good chance for them. Claudia Sornosa to offer the service. Right to the box, saved by Murphy. In those games, they played Sweden twice, England, Netherlands, Portugal, France. Good teams. Moran gives it away. Gonzalez. Shot from distance. Nearly did the job. Gets a little bit of space. Too slow to step. who nearly scored from distance earlier. Now with the corner, right in the middle of the area. Desperate defending here. Goal for Spain! The Spanish are ahead in the 39th minute. Laia Fodina scuttles it across the line, and the Americans have fallen behind. Unable to clear it. Aren't able to get this second ball out of there. No one steps. Falls right to Cornina, and she does a little toe poke. Traffic. Casey Murphy can't see it. Just to get something on it. Oh, and you see the disappointment in the United States. No player steps. It looks like they're waiting a little bit. So much traffic. Deborah Bianchi. It's the final touch on the opening 45 minutes from Estadio El Salar. Looks like that substitution was for Rodman with Sophia Smith moving to that right side. Patch into the nine. Drops for Rapino. Rapino to the back post. There's Horan. Her header well off the mark, but an early chance in the second half for the United States. Haley Mace with a big play at the near post. Still not cleared for the Americans. Rapino real late to that one. And she will be into the book. Bianchi opting for yellow. Comes out in Atenea del Castillo. A player to that we really, really like at the summer's European Championships. Who wears the number 10 for Spain is about to come on. Yeah, and this is a player who, with fresh legs, mind you, coming in. With less than a year ago before the World Cup, Spain, a team a lot of people think would be dangerous. That looms large. Crystal Dunn checking yeah, in the game. Always good to see Crystal Dunn going back to the Spanish situation. And there comes San Coffey as well. One of the things I know we learned as a team is as players. So we always knew we were safe because we were all in it together. If you cut one of us, you cut all of us. So it's going to be interesting as well from the player side. Doesn't look like they're there yet. And I don't know what's happening behind the scenes, but that's the most effective way. Dangerous ball here. Esther Gonzalez, the header. Just glances wide of the far post. Sanchez wearing the number two comes on. Pino will lead off the far side of the field. So it looks like Rose Lavelle pops up high into that. Looks again. Giving goal for Hernandez. Oyan Hernandez. What a touch! Que golazo! Esther Gonzalez! Que has hecho! two around Don, and then all the space in the world, but what a finish this is by Gonzalez. Esther Gonzalez letting it come across her body, as hard as that is, and then with her left foot, not 
pushing it wide, redirecting it perfectly into the corner, but just too easy. 2 nothing with less than 20 minutes to play. Not going to Nofsky making another change. Alyssa Thompson, fresh off her debut with the senior national team at just 17 years of age. And potential. Playing for an MLS Next Boys under 17 team. Think about that. Her sister, Giselle, just scored in the 8-0 win against India today with the under 17. Sweden will definitely be in the group, right? You just you know that. <laughs> Nigeria. <laughs> it's a given. Match. Imagine. Fouling. Falls to Sanchez on her left. Not going to beat Rodriguez with that. Ashley Hatch running interference. Better by Cook. Misa Rodriguez, as she has been all night. And Ascona wearing the number 16 will replace Maite Oroz. And there it is, the final whistle from Estadio El Sarar in Pamplona, Spain.